because the violence of our time is caused by obedience. Throughout American history, the political leaders have always exhorted the American people to be nice and quiet and leave things to them. But when very serious evils confronted the American people, they had to go beyond the congressmen and the senators, and they had to commit civil disobedience, and they had even to break the law. And the abolitionists had to do it. And right here in Boston, they had to violate federal law by trying to bring a slave uh, away from the federal marshals. They had to commit civil disobedience. Uh, the labor movement had to do this. They had to violate the law. They had to disrupt things. They had to do all sorts of impolite things. They had the sit-ins of uh, sit-down strikes of 1936 and 37. And only this finally brought that modicum of justice that the labor movement demanded. And the civil rights movement went through the same thing. And you know that Congress did not act on the civil rights laws of 63, uh, of 64 and 65 until blacks went out into the street.